Well, surge in COVID cases is not keeping people from traveling this holiday season. And AAA expects 110 million people to travel for the holidays. That's close to pre-pandemic levels. It also says only 80 million people traveled for the holidays last year. So you can see the increase there. Tampa International Airport says it expects 65,000 to 75,000 people to pass through each day throughout the holiday season. And today expected to be one of the busiest travel days of the season with just two days until Christmas. ABC Action News reporter Stassi almost joining us live from TPA where it is already busy this morning, Stassi. That's right. Good morning here at the Tampa International Airport. They say they're seeing passenger numbers eight to nine percent higher than other airports across the country. As you can see behind me, one of the busiest terminals here would be C. People heading to the gates for Southwest Alaska and Breeze. And you know, it's 530 in the morning. Not too bad out here, but we are seeing the crowds coming out. You know, I was thinking about all the workers who make this happen. Airlines took a hit during the pandemic, and as people began traveling again, airports in general still weren't able to to fully restaff. So I met a Tampa resident here who pushes passengers in wheelchairs and helps with their luggage. He was laid off for three months during the pandemic and facing homelessness. Now that he's been back to work, he is putting in overtime for the holidays, six days a week, eight or more hours, and his pay is actually under $7 an hour. And he's allowed to make under minimum wage because he relies on tips. All right, we're going to hear from him coming up at the 630 hour, but you know, he says it's getting a lot busier as you can see behind me, more people traveling. So, uh, you know, with the cost of living here in Tampa, those tips really help him pay for his rent and all of his other necessities. So if you are one of the millions of people traveling, you know, through the airports across the country, remember those types of workers this holiday season reporting live at the Tampa airport. I'm Stassi Almos, ABC Action News.